Hey guys, how's it going? I see you here. Welcome to another video. In this video, we are going to discuss how to create drip campaigns, how to perform bulk actions and go high level. So assuming you have a number of people, you have a list of contacts, you want them to be a part of a drip campaign. That means you want them to receive automated messages with your offers. And in this video, we're exactly going to learn how to create that type of drip campaign but before we do that make sure you subscribe to the channel to get more updates like this and let's look into how to create a drip campaign now so first of all i'm in automations and what i want to do is i want to create a new workflow so this is the workflow that will potentially contain all the emails and text messages that uh, that you're going to send them right so uh this will be just a basic workflow without any trigger so we, we are not going to have any trigger because we are just adding them through a bulk action from the contact section so we don't have to trigger this workflow for a contact using uh this over here basically we're just gonna create a series of email like this will be email one like you're gonna have the subject and the body over here you will just have another sms right so you're gonna have like wait for maybe one day and then again email to and so on and so forth so you can keep creating this you can like create a long series of emails and sms and voicemails and whatever you want like there's a lot of things you can do like emails sms call voicemail instagram messenger as long as you have their uh, Facebook and Instagram connection you can send them those things also so you see a lot of stuff you can do so these are the external communications you can send them through the drip campaign right so once you hit publish and once you hit save the workflow will be live now let's name this workflow so I'm gonna call it drip campaign December right and now uh, hit save Next, what we're going to do is we're going to go to contacts. Now, if you don't know how to import contacts in high level, you can watch my video. I'll link that in the description. But assuming you know how to do it or after you watch that video, you will be able to upload a list of contacts in high level. So I've actually already uploaded the list I want uh, this trip campaign to send to. So I just want to basically select all the list, uh, all the contacts here and hit this robot icon over here at the campaign or workflow. So after clicking this, it's going to ask me, well, that's a big step. Before you do, just think about it. You're selecting all the contacts. Are you sure? And I'm going to say, yes, I'm, I am sure. And just proceed. Now, this is the fun part, right? So you can add them all at once. Now, there's a problem if you add them all at once to the workflow. Like it's going to send instantly thousands of mails. Like I have 1700 contacts, right? So it's going to send 1700 emails and SMS at once. What I want to do is I want to click on this. This is the drip mode uh, of high level, right? So I'm going to just name this uh drip campaign so this is the name of the drip action i'm performing so it's gonna start on maybe tomorrow right and it's gonna contain a batch quantity of maybe 100 or maybe 50 right so at once i'm gonna add 50 people to the workflow that means 50 sms and emails are gonna go out and repeat after one hour so I'm sending 50 every one hour. Basically, I'm adding every uh, every 50 contacts every one hour, right? And you could limit the number of days. Maybe don't send uh, just uh, in Saturdays and Sundays. And also you could do start from like process between hours. So this trip action that we are going to perform, if we just add to campaign and workflow, it's going to perform in between 12 a.m. to maybe 12 p.m. Something like that, right? Maybe you just select between the work hours right and once you hit add to campaign it's gonna start the drip campaign and i'm not gonna start a crazy drip campaign right now instead what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna show you once you add the drip campaign once you make it live it's gonna show up here so it's gonna be showing up here and you can easily see the status of your drip campaign what's the percentage if it's paused if it's live and stuff like that so this is how you create a drip campaign in uh in your high level account if you like the video 
make sure you subscribe to the channel to get more updates like this and that's it for today i'll see you in the next one